Let's talk about this story that is currently happening in Zambia of a 22 years old mobile money agent by the name of Pamela Chisupa who is currently in captivity and being severely tortured by her captors who have stole money from her collected money from her family and her currently still demanding more money before she could get released. A video of her torturous ordeal is circulating around Facebook and it's brutal. In the video, you could see the men beating her with metal rods as she speaks into the camera, talking to her family and begging them to send money for her release. At a point in the video, she was hit on her head, causing her to bleed. This is a horrible situation right now and up to this moment and as at the time of making this video, nothing has been heard from her captors and nothing has been heard from her. The video of her being beaten was originally sent to her parents to urge them to bring the money quickly but somehow the video leaked to the public and is now currently in circulation. And since the video is now in circulation, the captors are no longer picking their calls which makes the situation even more scary because it seems like those people are capable of doing worse. Right now, there is a call for finding Pamela. So the story can only develop from here onwards. And we are hoping that she comes back home alive, at least. So what really happened to Pamela? How did she get herself into this situation? Now, Pamela was said to be a money agent. She had a booth where she dispensed money to people who need money. Some countries will call it the POS business. So in the early hours of the 18th of April, it was said some strange men came to her booth and invited her for business in regards money transaction. It's unclear where or how. It's not particularly stated if she was called to a private house or if she was called to a vehicle because I know the mobile money involves them moving from one place to another. In as much as she has a boot, if someone requires her services at another location, I guess she's required to go there to serve them. And I'm guessing that might have been the situation with her because I don't imagine they could have kidnapped her in public without anyone seeing anything. So I'm going to guess she was taken to a really private location and when she went there thinking she was going to do a business transaction with these people, she ended up getting robbed. And as if that was not enough, they demanded her parents' phone number in which they called the parents and demanded more money. The parents immediately sent more money hoping that their daughter would be released. However, the kidnappers demanded more money still. And when the parents were delaying, they made a video of her being tortured, urging her to convince her family to send the money or her life would be in danger. Then they sent the video to the family and eventually someone in the family leaked the video to the public. I guess the family couldn't handle this themselves because they don't know how much more money these people would keep demanding. I'm not going to lie, I'm worried for her. And if for some reason she recognized the faces of her captors, then only God can help us. She was just a young girl trying to make a living for herself. It was her business and she only just started. And these evil people just decided to traumatize her. So please like and share this video so everyone can know the situation with Pamela. And hopefully if there is an update to this story, I'll be sure to let you guys know.